are in Vegas. Mm, My honey's been hungry mm -hmm. and she's been doing some incredibly healthy food and inspiring me too. And we're at this place called oh, the Juice, Juice Bar, Bar Veggie Cafe. Cafe. Woo! We're very happy. It's fresh organic food. Now, why is this important, you might say? What do you tell them, Sid? Well, it's important because the more healthy you are, the more sexy and energetic you feel. And it's just, oh, it's so delicious. The food comes alive, you know? Like, you want your passion to be alive. You gotta have your food to be alive. Yeah, so if you're so eating really cruddy us, stuff you know? and you want your husband or your wife or your lover to like be, you know, like all over you, well, you're heavy. Your body is just trying to, you know, process and digest a lot. We're not gonna get a soap opera about diet, but you get it's the idea. It's what we do, okay? It's what we do. Okay, so let's get in here. Take a look. Oh, we met this really cool guy. You gotta see this guy. Yeah. And he can't stop talking because he's like on fire. Hey, Jason. Alfarth, how are okay, you? Okay, we're gonna get you over here. Okay. I'll point the camera to you guys. So, Jason. Can I wear my silly hat? Is that okay? I'm, Absolutely. Yes, I love your silly hat. <laughs> so, Just love and happiness. So, this what is you feel is a good ingredient to keep your passion ignited and, and why you're here and what brought you here. Uh, I and maybe how couples could be served from this. Okay. Yeah, I came to Las Vegas. Uh, I'm a single dad. Uh, so maybe I'm not the best demographic right, for this interview, cool. but I could tell you um, uh, there's an unconditional love in this world, and that's the ability to go out and heal yourself first. If you can heal yourself first, you can come to Las Vegas and you can have the best time, and you, and you, and, uh, you can share so many wonderful experiences out here. It's the most beautiful, port, uh, most beautiful place in the world. You go to these can canyons, they're so serene. And if you if you're if you want to ignite your relationship, you go out into these canyons. You realize what you're what you have in these canyons. It's the most amazing thing. It's you have the world at your fingertips, and it's very very spiritual and healing. You do you walk around. There's beautiful cactus there. The air is so amazing. Like you just breathe the air. And you you know what you say to your partner? You say to your partner, it's a, an amazing thing to be alive today, and I'm happy to be here to share it with the time here with you. And uh, in terms of intimacy, that's probably the most amazing thing you could probably do is come out to this part of the world. And everything right here is at your fingertips, so. You know, when we just yeah. were chatting a little earlier, uh -huh. we were talking about, okay, your ex, uh -huh. about how your best are friends. I wanna hear about that. So some of you who are single or your, you know, past relationships, past exes and all that, what's your advice on that? Or I, don't, I don't know if I have any real advice, but I could tell you failing is the best thing. In other words, uh, it, I have an ex-wife, three years, her name is AJ. She's beautiful, she's from Turkey. Uh, she's the she's the mother of my uh, two beautiful daughters, and from that love, we we have the most amazing daughters that were with me in Las Vegas this meeting this weekend, and they came out and supported their dad over 40 uh, you know over 40 soccer tournament. But I feel like I'm six or seven. I became a raw vegan like eight, eight months ago, so it's been the most amazing experience uh, of my life just to be able to go out and see the world. Uh, but uh, AJ and I, uh, the, the most important thing I think I've learned in my life from our relationship was the most amazing thing, it's called uh, forgiveness. In other words, uh, it, when you say to yourself, oh, I'm crazy, I hate you, I, you know, or, and you're holding this negative energy, uh, that works more against you than the other person. You know, because you could be saying that, but they're not feeling that. So you release that and you say, uh, I forgive you, uh, and we'll move on. So now because of that, we have a wonderful uh, relationship. We've, we've been friends. Uh, she takes our daughters to Turkey. Jason, come to Turkey this summer. AJ, come to Las Vegas this summer. So although we didn't work out as a, you know, official couple, yeah. uh, I think we're, are, we're on the same page. Uh, I think we have a very good, you know, uh, connection now. A really amazing you. connection, yeah. I don't know if I'm saying the right things or the wrong things, but I'm just speaking from my... That's yeah, exactly, yeah. that's exactly yeah. what we're... What, this is all about just like a real, real life, real thing. And um, just the, 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 the part that you... It seems like you have respect and appreciation for her. And when you said, you know, we brought these beautiful children here oh, yeah. and just the, the love that I feel that you have and, and you radiate that, and that's awesome. That's how we had to connect with you. Yeah, huh? Thanks, brother. Oh, my, 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 okay. my pleasure. Thank my you. He's awesome. He, he just started talking to us, you know, like out of the blue. We um, we walked in here and, and he was just like, hey, you know, this raw food, it's great. Hey, you want to try this? You want to try that? And it was like, yeah, we, we love meeting people like you. Go juice, your, go juice something today and juice your lover. Get passionate. Mm -hmm. That's See what ya. it's about. Wow. <laughs>